Hey everybody, I just wanted to record a really quick demonstration video for you uh, to demonstrate a plugin that I found that is going to be super, super useful for us at High Res Digital and hopefully useful for you guys too. So this plugin is called ACF Duplicate Repeater. Um, and basically what it does is it takes things like uh, flexible content with an ACF and adds the ability to duplicate uh, one of those blocks or rows. Um, this is going to save us loads of time in developing sites. Um, I'll just kind of show you what I mean. So we're working on the new High Rise Digital website at the moment and we're building that using flexible content, ACF flexible content. And what we tend to do is we tend to like build a kind of layout module. In this case, we're calling it a feature row. Uh, so if you see on this page, we've got like uh, images and text left and right. Sometimes it's a gallery. Uh, sometimes it'll be a video, etc. We've got different kind of background color options. There's like background image options and things as well. Um, so we create that block type. And then what we want to do is kind of stress test that. So how does it look with a background color, without a background color, with a background image, with text left, with text right, uh, with a gallery instead of an image, with a video, whatever. So we want, we want to kind of test all those different variations. Um, but adding the content to do that has typically taken a lot of time. Um, and I wanted to speed that up. So I did a quick Google search, as you do, and I stumbled across this plugin. Um, so it's by MacGuffin, uh, it's on GitHub, uh, it's called ACF Duplicate Repeater. So if you go to this URL up here, um, you can see that. Uh, and then if you scroll down just to where it says installation instructions, it's just a really standard WordPress plugin installation. Click on releases, um, I grabbed version one, so I just clicked on this. Uh, installed it on this site and I haven't activated it yet so I want to show you something. So this is kind of what the back end kind of currently looks like for that page so we can see all the different feature rows if I expand one of those uh, we'll see the kind of content for that feature row um, and also the options like background color background images whether or not to use light text we've got custom classes and things like that. As you can see kind of recreating that time and time again is is time consuming. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to plugins. You can see it's been installed, but it hasn't been activated. So I'm just going to activate this plugin. Uh, that is not active. And if I go back to this page and refresh that page. Now, whenever I hover over, there's an extra little icon here and it's called duplicate layout. So if I take, for example, let me see, there's one of these is a gallery one. Which one is it? One, two, three, four. It's the fourth one down is a gallery. It's number four here. Let's just check that that's the case. Yeah, lots of images in there. So if I click duplicate layout, duplicate layout, it adds it. And I think what it does is it adds it in above um, the one that's uh, already there. So four and five now should both be galleries and they should be exactly the same. Um, let me just check that. Just refresh that, wait for that to refresh. So this gallery feature row should be duplicated. Gallery feature row, gallery feature row. Now how much quicker was that than having to go in and add all this again? <laughs> so that's hopefully gonna save us a whole load of time. We're also working on uh, a kind of uh, export file that we can install in new sites uh, that kind of pre-populate all of this because it's a kind of standard uh, blocks plugin that we're using. Um, hopefully that'll save us a bit of time too. Um, but I hope that's been useful. I just kind of wanted to demo that. It's super simple, right? But um, it should save us a lot of time. Hopefully you a lot of time too. Um, let me know how you get on with it. If you find any problems, if you've got any other better ideas, uh, always love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Bye.